Hey guys, so today I'm doing the Holly Jolly Holiday Tag, and I wasn't tagged, which is perfectly fine with me. I'm still going to do tags, even if I'm not tagged. But I am going to put in the description box a couple of people that I do personally want to tag, because I want to see your videos. And if anybody else does this, just leave it as a video response, and I will watch it, because I like these questions. They're pretty cool. So, um, I'm going to get started. So, the first question is your favorite Christmas movie. Now, it took me a really long time, because I did pre-plan these uh, questions in my head. It took me a really long time to figure out what my favorite Christmas movie was. I do like those really classic movies that you see on ABC Family, like Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer and, um, what is it, Santa Claus is Coming to Town. Like, I like those because they're cute, but my favorite Christmas movie would have to be The Grinch. I think that movie is so adorable. I think Whoville is so cute. Like, if I could live in, like, one of those houses, I would because they're so cute. So The Grinch is definitely my favorite Christmas movie. The next question is, are you on the naughty list or the nice list? And because I'm making a video and putting it on YouTube, I feel obligated to say the nice list. But, I mean, let's be honest here. I know I've done a few bad things in my life, so, um, I technically would probably be on the naughty list, so, uh, I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, the next question is awkward. The next question is, show us an embarrassing Christmas card photo, and in quotations it says, we know you have one. Um, actually, I don't have one, which is, like, really surprising and weird. We don't take pictures in order to put in Christmas cards. We don't take family pictures often, actually. So when my mom puts the Christmas cards together, she just puts, like, our um, school picture, like, little wallet-sized ones in there. So I really don't have any to show you. Sorry. That's embarrassing, too, though. Next question is, have you ever had a white Christmas? Yes, I have. The first 11 years of my life, until I was 11, I lived in Ohio. So obviously I had a extremely white Christmas. And I remember when I used to live with my grandma, um, she had she would always put her tree in front of like her dining room table. And like her dining room had this big window that just, you, you could just open like drapes. Like it was so big. So I remember the first Christmas that we spent with her. Um, she opened the window, like, right Christmas morning, and it was so bright, but the snow was, like, falling down, and, like, behind the tree, it was just so pretty, and, like, I guess when I was younger, it, it was, like, super magical to have a white Christmas, and now it's just, like, oh, snow, great, you know, you know what I'm saying? But, um, yeah, I have had a white Christmas. The next question is, where do you usually spend your holidays? I don't have a specific place that I spend my holidays, because, um, we move a lot, military things. When I was younger, I mean, we spent it in Ohio with my family, with my grandparents. Um, since we moved down here, we spent it, like, at the house. We went to Disney World one year. So, I mean, we kind of just go back and forth. We like going different places because my dad likes to travel. So we don't really spend our Christmas or holidays anywhere specific. But we do tend to stay at the house more often than not. Um... The next question is, play or sing your favorite Christmas song? I'm not down to sing. Uh, let's not even do that. So I do have my favorite Christmas song ready to play. It's um, Carol of the Bells by Trans-Siberian Orchestra. And a little backstory, my mom had one of those Christmas CDs that has, like, Christmas songs on it. You know what I mean? And um, this song was on it, and it was probably the only song that I thought felt more modern than classic. So I really, really liked it. So I'm just going to play a little bit of it. So... It's like, sorry, that's like really awkward just to hear and be like, hmm. So yeah, I love that song to death. It's probably my favorite Christmas song ever because I feel like it's just so, like, me. Like, you know what I mean? I love that song. Okay, um, actually I had it on my iPod a long time ago. I don't even know why. Okay, moving on. Um, the next question is, do you open any presents on Christmas Eve? One Christmas Eve we did, um, because my dad's like a little kid at heart, so he was very anxious, and we opened all of our presents, and we didn't have any presents for Christmas Day, so we felt really bad and said we weren't allowed to do that anymore. So, um, we did it one time. Okay. Uh, the next question is, can you name all of Santa's reindeer? Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, Cupid, is it... Don Donner? Donner? Blitzen. I almost said Donald. Blitzen and then Rudolph. Is that right? If I just got that right, I'm going to be so proud of myself. Okay. Um, what holiday holiday tradition are you looking forward to most this year? My family doesn't really have any traditions. Um, my parents are so, like, chill that we don't really do anything. We just kind of chill. Um, so, holiday tradition... Open presents. I don't know. <laughs> um... Is your Christmas tree real or fake? We always get a real Christmas tree since we moved down here because there's this, like, um, 
place, like a farm, that we go and pick our Christmas tree, and then we ride like on a hayride through like lights and artificial snow, and then we eat at this like homestyle restaurant. So like if you know me personally, you know what I'm talking about because you live here and you've probably gone there. But um, yeah, we do get a real Christmas tree. And I'm not saying that I hate fake trees because like I had a cat one year that would climb up our tree. So that would probably be the instance where I would get a fake tree. I love how I'm giving you like a backstory. That's great. The um, next question is, hands down, what's your all-time favorite holiday food and holiday sweet treat? Holiday food is deviled eggs because I freaking love eggs eggs like I know that's so weird like like when I say that I think of like the Amanda show when it's like girls bathroom girls in the room or whatever and that girl's like I like eggs you know what I mean I feel like a retard when I say that but I love deviled eggs they're so good and holiday sweet treat pies like any pie cheesecake like I just I love cake it's really good um be honest do you like giving gifts or receiving gifts better Honestly, I would like to say that I love giving gifts. I, I do like giving gifts. I like the proud moment that you get when they're opening your gift. I'm like, oh, you know, I love it. And you're just like, yes. But um, honestly, I do like receiving gifts better. It's just, I don't know. I had to be the person that said it. Sorry. It's just, I, I like receiving them. Um, the next question. Show us your tackiest Christmas attire. So last year, um, the yearbook class kind of put together this day. It was like the day before Christmas break or whatever, that everybody had to wear, like, Christmas clothes. So for this, I went shopping with Gabby and Cassie, and I don't talk to them anymore, which is, like, really sad. But, um, we went shopping, we went to Belk, and I found this adorable vest. Um, oh yeah, it's, it's cute. It's a cardigan vest. It's a red one, and it has, um, snowflakes on it with sequins, and then kittens and stockings! Look how freaking cute those are! Like, come on. Like, I'm thinking about wearing this this year because it is so cute. And it's got little fish. Like, look at that. So, it's not really tacky to me. I'm just kidding. But it's really, really cute, and I love that. I also got a shirt, too. It had, like, a polar bear on it with, like, a puff. It was cute, but I don't have it to show you. Um, next question is, what would your be your dream place to visit? Spitting. For the holiday season. So, like I said before, I went to Disney, and that's probably my dream place to go because I loved it. It was magical and wonderful and my heart like every time I go so like I'm such a kid like every time I see like Disney I cry because I'm so excited so um probably Disney yeah that's, that's about it um does your family have a special holiday recipe you like to help make we don't have a special recipe but I do like to help make cookies because I can eat the frosting so yeah uh, are you a pro present wrapper or do you fail miserably? I suck at wrapping. I'm a girl. I should be fantastic at wrapping, but I suck. I'm one of those people that when you get like a soap bottle or whatever, I like wrap it up in there and then like put tape everywhere to keep it shut and you can't open it. I'm that person. So I'm really sorry about that. Uh, the next question is your most memorable holiday moment. This is really depressing, but probably just Disney. I don't really have any memorable holiday moments. Nothing crazy or spectacular has happened to me, but Disney is honestly so magical, like I said, like four times. So I had a really good time there. Uh, the next question is, what made you realize the truth about Santa? Another Debbie Downer moment. I feel like I have knew it all along. I just... It's really sad. But I felt like I did know it all along. Like, I just... I, I guess... I just guessed. Um, the next question is, do you make a New Year's resolutions, and do you stick to them? I made a New Year's resolution last New Year's, and I have stuck to it, and I'm not going to say what it is. I'm going to wait till like, the end of this year to say it, but I think I'm going to make one this year, and probably not stick to it, because it's one of those, like, working out ones and get in shape, but I'm so lazy that I'm probably not going to do it, so, no, I, I guess I don't really stick to them except for this one. And then the last question is, what makes the holidays special for you? Not being in school, being with your family, cuddling in big cozy blankets and drinking hot chocolate with your mom and watching videos and movies and opening presents and just being happy in general. So I love the holidays. I hope you guys enjoyed this tag. Um, subscribe to me if you're not already. And yeah, bye guys.